I was once arrested by border guards for illegally entering another country. <laughs> David's team, what do you think? Wh which country? <laughs> it was in the mid-90s. That's not a country. No. <laughs> And it was in Eastern Europe, so they changed names very quickly. So I'm not sure. It was either Czech Republic or Czechoslovakia. I don't know which... You know, what stage of its yeah, exactly. dissolution it was at. Mm. Yeah. And what was the problem? I didn't have my passport. Right. Where had you left your passport? At home. <laughs> <laughs> Who were you with, by the way? Were you on your own? Or no, was I was with a friend from back home, Pitt. Friend from the pit? No, it was a person called Pete. Is that his real name? Or is that a nickname? Pete. Oh, Pete. No, oh. P P I T. Oh, Pete. Pit. Oh, oh Pit. Pit. Oh, Pit. Oh, Pit. He's got his own Pete. I would like Brad Pitt, oh. but yeah. Pete is his yeah. first name. Otherwise, I would say Pete. Yeah. <laughs> we were travelling on something that was called Schönes Wochenend ticket. And that's German for National Express. No. <laughs> now, what it is German for, you can use any train you like as long as it's a slow train. <laughs> we have that system with all of our trains. <laughs> <laughs> OK, so you get off the train at the border. You do. Is it at that moment you realise you don't have your passport? Yes. So we wanted to go into Czech Czechoslovakia. So I didn't have my passport. So the obvious thing to do is don't go across where the border guards are, <laughs> but go a mile off into the fields <laughs> and cross there. If then someone wants to see your passport, you say, oh, I must have lost it. <laughs> <laughs> Roughly how far into Czechoslovakia, in whatever form it was, were you? I was about give or take a mile. I see in the distance, I see like two lights, two white lights. They're getting bigger and bigger and bigger. <laughs> and then I realise it's a jeep. And then they're driving towards us. <gasps> I'm quite gripped by this story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the jeep then just stopped and then there is four people jumping out with automatic rifles <gasps> and dogs. Automatic dogs? <laughs> What sort of dogs were they? I didn't ask for their names. But... <laughs> Neither did Alex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were terrifying dogs, probably Alsatians or something. What happened? They, they're all around you. So well, what they do all they jump out with their rifles, don't they? And I'm saying, oh, v -v -v of whatever their language is. So, <laughs> and then... <laughs> yeah, and then we had to gain the Jeep, and when we were driving off, into Czechoslovakia, and then we ended up in some woods. One of them jumps out, opens the gate, and I didn't even see what was there. Then there is some little wooden hut. And was someone in there that spoke German. We even got on well with that fella, and our excuse was that we said, we had no idea that we crossed the border. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, and then, well, they didn't fully buy it, <laughs> but they knew there was little point executing us. <laughs> <laughs> what happens then? And now the funny story begins. <laughs> <laughs> they said, <laughs> you'll have to pay a penalty. Oh, the Germans that, and penalties. That penalty... Never again, please. Then the Czechs drove us back to the German border, handed us over to the German border guards, oh. and then they congratulated us on being the first illegal immigrants from Germany into Czechoslovakia. <laughs> well, there we are. David, what are you and your team thinking? It's the travel mm. card thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just... It just seems right. No, I think... <laughs> On an emotional level, having spent so long hearing that story, <laughs> <laughs> I sort of need it 
to be true. Yeah. We need something. We need it to be true yeah. because a lot of our life went into that. Mm. <laughs> so so yes, you're going to say true. On that emotional level, I think we have to say true. You're saying it's true. Henning, truth or lie? Well, that story is actually true. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that was true. Henning did get arrested for illegally entering another country.